Welcome back guys, crypto for channel. Today I would like to talk about Solana, Sol USDT, trading pair with Makasa Medicare SAR updates. Let's dive in. This is a monthly time frame and all targets, personally for me, absolutely relevant. And uh, yes, uh, this chart remind me of the Fetch AI and the Injective. And you remember that 27 block, collapse of uh, FTX crash, uh, we didn't close the 50% of this uh, monster gap. Globally, yes, I still think we will see the new all-time high. Yes, this cycle, because we still didn't see the main altcoin season. Yes, so pump it, pretty good. So we can count like from uh, December 2020, Sol already made a 2,500% gains and it's pretty, pretty good gains, right? I think the top for Sol can be this cycle around 373. It will be around 4,500% gains. Yes, of course, uh, a lot of people uh, think that Sol uh, going parabolic like Ethereum and we skyrocket to 1K or even to 2K. But guys, I'm more conservative. With my targets so it's a three point a 373 1.61 2.61 it's 558 so this is a uh for me it's going to be the crazy gains right six uh solid 800 percent gains uh, 558 for soul it's going to be just a crazy rally right of course of course all next steps also relevant so depends of your risk depends of uh uh your uh, expectations, right? So it depends on your strategy. So I'm more conservative with targets. So take a look. Uh, of course, we can see the chart like uh, NVIDIA. So we move like this one. So NVIDIA already hit this target. So who knows, who knows? We just work with possibilities. But guys, uh, be careful because um, take a look. The people who accumulated uh, not here, we talk about this accumulation in December at $8. These people already made 2,000% gains and the people can take a profit. Normally, I don't think so. We'll drop to this block again to 68 or uh, to under $76. But we can see the impulse, sideways impulse. So usually like this one. because Or, or of course, we can see impulse correction to, you know, from impulse around 0.61 low by FIP and C76, this one recover back personally now from 135 uh, dropped to $42 to test uh, 18 level by FIP uh, sounds like unrealistic idea right that's why I think if we go to weekly time frame I think we should hold the line yes we can sweep it locally this one this liquidity pool this one and this we got a two liquidity pools right so would be good and would be logical to see something like this move and recover back in other case right so it can be the bad scenario if we not hold the line not sweep it just crash it down like this one in this case of course the bitcoin dominance have to go over than 56 percent 58 percent you know so in this case yes uh, altcoins can bloody more uh, but uh, imagine if a soul draw can drop from uh, 135 to uh, 70 nine sixty nine uh, what other altcoins will do <laughs> pretty pretty hard so just in case uh, this is two main support blocks now for Sol. uh most positive scenario if we just uh, sweep uh, this liquidity pool test uh, 23 by feet you know and recover back to the next steps 220 235 373 and yes it can be there for example one two like this one and maybe three Three drives better. Who knows? We will see. But globally, of course, I still think the soul can hit new all-time high this cycle. Let's take a look uh, with my customer cursor. What's going on now with the whales? We are in accumulation again. So this was a time step-by-step -step distributed or token. For example, you accumulated here in last accumulation stage, like 17. Then at the top, at uh, 77. It's a good idea to at least withdraw initial deposit. Then we got a huge divergency on a weekly right and the uh, top at uh, 210 also take a look maybe maybe we're gonna form it the biggest uh, divergency ever here this is a top imagine this is a top in april somewhere one another top but divergency right and now we form the uh 
yearly, basically the yearly divergency. And yes, we can see something like this one. Top, drop, top, and drop. Uh, on the chart, it can look like this one. And will be new bear market. So just in case, because yes, we can form the uh, next uh, top, but lower than this one and then this one but higher on the chart. So it's gonna be the pretty, pretty clean signal out of soul and the fixed profit. Guys, just in case, take a look, um, direction, direction market mode. Here, it was accumulation, now it uh, was a distribution. So now we're just in the middle, but you remember, a flash crash, if we dump it lower, yes, we can dump again here, forming something like double bottom, and we will see that once again, signals to buy, so it's gonna be the basically negative scenario. A positive scenario if we hold the line at middle line and go in higher again. New high, new signals to fixed profit. Take a look, also it was a signal. I come late coin, now it's distribution. So I would like to see also divergency on ma uh, market mood. Once again, something like this one and like this one on a chart. So yes, guys, uh, globally, globally, I think uh, Seoul will hit new all-time high. How uh, high it's pump, it's hard to say. Uh, money power, mm, money inflow, money inflow, money inflow, now money outflow, and I would like to see one more uh, money inflow on the weekly time frame. So let's add alert. Yes. If we'll see one more money inflow, it's gonna be the, the best signal for, um, uh, for continuation and also take a look exactly at the top in March we got a signal to fixed profit every side bearish divergency take a look on two less indicators trade on on trade on uh, here it was signals to accumulate position here was a, a lot of signals to fixed profit and now no new signal to buy so basically yes I, t I repeat it this is not a time for accumulation take profit indicator also uh, why uh, we can drop it lower because take a look the exit line it's 91 40 uh, 45 and take profit line it's uh, 80 dollar 42 but uh, with a uh, with a test of 75 dollar but mm, it can be the pretty pretty hard drop if we'll see the on um, this one flash crash re retest it and close the first uh, muscle gap 45 percent down so just be ready so just be ready because i don't think so of course I don't think so. We will drop and test the forty dollar the buy line. Uh, why do I don't think so? We'll drop because we don't have enough time. Uh, yes, yes. The same story. You can open the Fetch AI. How to pump it? Uh, let me show you. Fat USDT. Take a look. So this was uh, the same story. So we didn't test test uh, this one uh, exit line and pump it. So the story on the fat was uh, pretty similar. So just in case, and injective, injective USDT, this one, the same story. So we pump it away over, and here we didn't retest it again, the exit line. And after pump to new all time high. So it's around like uh, 380, 500 for Seoul, this area. And after that, we re go in and retest it. So that's the case. What we can see uh, basically for Seoul uh, on a Binance. So we can see one more pump. And only after that, like this one, we can see the drop to exit line here, for example, and then new bear market. So just in case. So guys, so work with proper risk management. If you would like to trade with my customer, you can what I showed you in this video, just write me DM. Subscribe channel, hit the like button, hit the notification button. Don't forget to join my Telegram channel. See you next time, guys.